Well, I want this. This heart goes out to my wife, and I love her so much. Tune in now. today, Kelvin. It's all yours. It's not complicated. It's your basic man on the street. Tell me, John Q. Jane Q. What does Valentine's Day mean to you? It gives me acid reflux. That's what it means to me. I mean, we spend a lot of money. Nobody cares. It's not even a real holiday. We don't take the day off. Come on, Susie. And we're coming back in five, four. Listen, I'm a player, but I shut down my playerness from New Year's to St. Patty's Day, just so I can avoid this day. Hi, welcome to your entertainment ticket, yeticket.com. You can get us at www.yeticket.com. This is John Delia. Yeah, Valentine's This is Alan Darnay. Hey, lovers. Hey, yeah, lovers. Why are you lovers out there? Well, we just saw Valentine's Day, directed by Gary Marshall. Oh, yeah. Gary Marshall. Oh, yeah. yeah. Yeah, that's right. And he was about 72 or 78, something like that. Ooh. I don't know. He looked it in his one yeah, cameo. One in that shot. Film. He had one shot in the film. It looked pretty good. Well, let me tell you who's in this movie real quick. Jessica Alba, Kathy Bates, Jessica Biel, Bradley Cooper, Eric Dane, Patrick Dempsey, Hector Alonzo, Jamie Foxx, Jennifer Gardner, Topper Grace, Anne Hathaway, Carter Jenkins, Ashton Kutcher, Queen Latifah, Taylor Lautner, and George Lopez. And Shirley MacLaine, Emma Roberts, Julia Roberts, Bryce Robinson, Taylor Swift. It would be, wow. easier. Yeah, it'd be, yeah. it'd be easier to list well, who people who weren't in the film. Yeah, you know, wasn't in the they, film. I wasn't in the film. Yeah, you I, wasn't in the I film. I didn't make the cast. If, oh. if you lived in Hollywood, I you got in this it. film. I read for it. <laughs> well, you know, this is a story about what happened to some people on Valentine's Day in uh, L.A. That's right, in L.A. Wow. John. What do you think of Valentine's Day? Well, let me, let's go into a little bit about it. Actually, it's a, a circle. It's, it's a movie plays in a circle. It's about all these people who actually have a minor connection, and as they meet, and it, each, each of the stories are told. And some of the stories aren't so great, and some of them are a lot of fun. There's people who just don't, are, don't get it on Valentine's Day, and some that get, it, get everything on Valentine's Day. And that's basically what the movie's about. It's, yeah. a, it's a little bit of a, it's a, it's a nice little cherry for all the heart lovers. Yeah, right, yeah. You're absolutely right. Alan, what do you think of the film, Alan? What do you think of the film? I think there were too many scenes, too many people, <laughs> not enough action, no laughs. Um, there were some laughs there. I didn't laugh. I don't know. I love to laugh, and I didn't laugh in this one. I think this movie was made strictly for the dollars that uh, can be poured out from this. I don't even think it's a really good date film because I don't think there's a lot to the movie. It's all fluff and, and no substance. Well, okay. Well, I enjoyed this film. I, I remember when we reviewed one uh, romantic comedy, I say, is this the end of romantic comedy? I remember, and, you, uh, I remember you saying yeah, that. Yeah, and that, uh, that movie, uh, When in Rome. When in Rome. No, When in Rome, one of the worst romantic comedies of all time. Anyway, uh, this really brought my faith back into romantic comedies. I really enjoyed this. I enjoyed all the actors in it and the characters that they portrayed, too. So I really enjoyed this film. I like the connections that they had. I really enjoyed that. And also the little snippets and everything, that was fun for me to watch. There were a few laughs in his and some surprises. That's why I like this movie. Uh, I sort of agree with Alan and Al. I'm just like in between all that. I just think it was a good way to pass time because you can see all the actors that you like and, and have been around and, and are doing really well and you get to see them on the screen and that's basically what this is all about. And, and Alan is right about that. It's, this is a lot of fluff uh, for the uh, maybe for the big dollars that's coming out. So Valentine's Day is nice. If you're a chick and you want to go to the movies, you want to bring a lot of your girlfriends along, you want to laugh a little bit. What? If you drag along your husband, you know what he's going to say to you? Well, you know, that was uh, a little gonna bit He's going to enjoy it, too. Man. Or the boyfriend's going to enjoy it also with you. Uh, they're going to enjoy this. You know. Good morning. Who are you? Um, I am Liz. I'm one of the receptionists. I'm talking to Monica. Oh, yeah, Monica. Because she wanted today off. She has uh, a life. Uh, uh, she had a funeral, which is a life, I guess. Well, Liz, I'm Paula. <clears throat> I know they call me bipolar Paula. Don't. But you should know I'm in crisis. OK. 
okay? I don't want to talk about it. Okay. It has nothing to do with being alone on Valentine's Day. Of course not. And everything to do with a client in crisis. That sounds challenging. <laughs> challenging? Gotta figure out if he still has an athletic career. If he doesn't, big fat problem. <laughs> well, I'm here to help you solve that problem. Who's on hold? My mother. I'm sorry. Hangs up on her own mother. That's cold. You might just get along. It, this movie's called Valentine's Day, and it's about a very, very nice little holiday that's, uh, that's a time for all lovers. So in, instead of coming to see this film, why don't you take your best, best girl out or, or take your best boy out and go see... Uh, Go to, a, go to not a movie, but some place where you can talk, sit, have dinner, and enjoy yourselves. You can do because that I don't movie. think you're going to enjoy this movie like that. Okay, but I've got to give some it. kudos to a couple of the people in the movie. I think Axton Kutcher was, I can't pronounce that guy's I, name, Ashton Kutcher <laughs> <laughs> was good. He was fun to watch. I like watching him. I like Anne Hathaway, though I don't think she, she was cast right in this movie. Queen Latifah, always good. Um, uh, Topher Grace, who is a really good actor, was wasted in this film. I, you know, I just, I guess I, I, I like love stories, and this really wasn't no, one. I, for thought me. Just, I thought this was pretty good. You brought up Ashton Kutcher, and stay. I'll tell you something. Stay for the credits because you'll get to see Ashton Kutcher, Kutcher, punked. Yeah, he was punked. He was punked. Yeah. Good. Yeah. All right. How many palm trees you give? Uh, give it two. How many palm trees you give? I'll, I'll give it two. I'm giving it four for the oh, entertainment value of it. Oh, and also, it's a romantic oh, comedy. It's a fun movie to watch. Oh, come on. No, the, the plane, when, when she was on no, the plane he, coming he, from the war. Oh, oh man. Oh. And also another character, when they got caught. Oh, man, this is a great movie. I enjoyed Valentine's Day. And I'm, I, I'm a really type of person. I really don't like romantic comedies, but I like this one. The way of love is not a subtle argument. The door there is devastation. The master. So according to Rumi, love has to be devastating. Oh, listen, you don't step into love, my friend. You fall in head over heels. You ever seen somebody fall head over heels in love? For real? Read? It's ugly, bro. Toxic, septic. Come on, boss. Still got a few hours left. Make something happen for somebody someplace. Cookie, day's not over yet, man. Give me some. Hey, tell me something. How'd you and your wife get it so right? It's easy. I married my best friend. Thought I was your best friend. Yeah, you're my man. That's my lady. Well, see Valentine's Day, you just you take somebody out for dinner or something. Yeah, so you right. take them to the movie first, then to the dinner, and then y'all can discuss the movie. That's what I say. Okay, I'll go along with that. Well, this is your entertainment ticket, yeticket.com. Thanks for watching. Hey, and keep watching us every day. And the day after. Ciao, babies. Wow. I can't wait to Valentine's oh, Day that, myself. I want, I want all that candy. And all that. <laughs> Who's going to give you candy? I got, oh, you, I got something like sweet candy. to Nobody's eat, but it's not candy. no candy, baby. Send candy in. Send candy. <laughs> um, is everything okay with Alex? Not really. Uh-oh, what happened? Alex and I were supposed to have sex today. <clears throat> for the first time. For both of us. I wanted it to be magical, and I'm realizing that it's hard to plan something to be magical, you know? Yes, that, that it is. Love can't be planned. It's not love. She's talking about Edgar. It is sex. He's, he's going to Stanford. I'm going to Yale. And it's just hit me recently that it's going to be really hard to stay together. So I guess I thought that if we had this amazing thing connecting us, it'd make it easier somehow. But I don't know. Hearing myself say it out loud at all it sounds really stupid. And it's not like I'm going to sleep with one person for the rest of my life, right? I mean, that's just crazy. Who does that? No. Crazy people like us, we did. No. Mm-hmm.